So guys, tell me who you play, and from your perspective, what is this story about? I play Scooney in, uh, in this movie, Neighbors, and um, the story is about a family, a new family with a newborn baby, and uh, a fraternity moves in next door, and at first they try to be good neighbors, and they try to relate and be friends, and then it all kind of goes downhill, and they, uh, they go to war. Yeah, I play uh, Garth, uh, also a frat brother. And uh, from Garth's perspective, the movie is about uh, people trying to stop him from smoking weed and listening to music. And he hates it. And he hates it. And that's he hates a great it. perspective. Yeah, yeah. This is just like, who keeps turning music I just want to smoke weed. I just want to get high and listen to music. Yeah. Talk about just the crazy, wild escalation of the rivalry. You know, yeah, it's it's funny because it starts off, you know, with them. I mean, it's, they all just want to protect the, the baby. I mean, Seth and Rose's character just want to protect this baby. And it starts off really, you know, subtle, and they try and get along. And, and, and then quickly, pretty quickly, Very quickly. it escalates oh, yeah. to this whole other thing where it's just like, a, you know, destroying each other's property. It just like, so it, it. I don't think there was ever even like a middle, like, you know, like, Cold War, where we're not speaking to it, just quickly became like, yep. we will destroy you. Once, once the condom was in the baby's mouth, it was game on. Game on. Yeah, but isn't that a metaphor for life? The condom in the baby. I don't mouth. know. <laughs> <laughs> oh we're gonna, we're gonna work that in somehow. Yeah. Look at that tattooed on my oh, chest. Yeah, get that condom out of that baby's mouth. Is the thing my grandfather. Always <laughs> what Barack's gonna say this next presidential speech? <laughs> we have to get the condom out. Republicans of uh, just keep putting the condom in. The baby's mouth of America. I'm sorry. <laughs> ah, which leads me to what was the most outrageous scene you had to shoot? Uh, wow. All the party scenes were pretty insane. We, so you much know, so it sent him to the hospital. It did. I had to go to the hospital after the big uh, smokehouse scene because I have a bad case of asthma. Mm -hmm. uh, but I also like the party scene is the intro. They cut it. Um, but it's it's introduction for all our characters, whereas Zach's character, Teddy, is running through a party knocking on doors and introducing each one yeah, of us. that's right. Where it cuts to him knocking and calling me out and I'm just masturbating on a computer. I'm just mm -hmm. like, give me 10 seconds, give me 10 seconds. And he walks down the hall and you hear me orgasm, obviously. Yeah, yeah. And then it cuts to him, like, Garth, we need you. And he's just high on ketamine. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's with like two days. drugged out girls next to you. Like, so dark. Yeah. It was a wild dark. scene. Very shoot. dark, yeah, yeah. Can't wait to see that in the next wow. We have to see yeah. that. I almost forgot about that scene. I know, me too. What an amazing comedic cast. Talk yeah, about working with this ensemble. Um, I think, uh, I mean, first of all, Rose may be my favorite is the funniest. character. She's, like, so funny. Yeah. So funny in there. And then you have, I mean, just like, wait, is that Lisa Kudrow? You know, like, like she's there. And just but like, I, I like that these guys, because obviously Seth has worked with, like, Fr James Franco and Jonah, like, a whole bunch. But he got his friends, but, like, a new group of friends. He got Dave. He got Ike. Mm -hmm. Carla, who's worked with many times, but Rose, these hilarious people that maybe haven't had their biggest time to shine, and they are amazing in this movie. It's this yeah. fresh new cast. I yeah. Think. yeah, it was yeah. fun. It was really fun. I'm in it. You're in it. You're in it for like 10 minutes. <laughs> Thank you both so much. Thank you so much. Take Thank care. You. Really nice to meet you.